local churches are closing their doors for good, we're learning about another concerning trend in the Diocese of Providence. No men are entering the seminary in the fall. Church leaders say they can't remember a time when this has ever happened. Iowa News reporter Julianne Lima is digging deeper into the reason why interest in the priesthood is dwindling and what's being done to keep local churches open. It's new at 530. In the past five years, between two and six men have entered the seminary every autumn. Although no men are applying this year, church leaders say it isn't time to panic just yet. Every fall, Our Lady of Providence Seminary welcomes a new class of aspiring priests, but that won't be the case this year. Entering the fall, we don't have any new seminarians applying for the Diocese of Providence, which is rare. I cannot remember a recent memory when the last time was. A look back at the numbers shows a declining trend. Five men entered the seminary in 2012 and six entered in 2013. Then the numbers dropped to three, two, and four in the years that followed. It's hard. You know, in some ways we live in a place where there are many opportunities, there are many options available to us, and sometimes that can be overwhelming. This lack of interest comes at a time when new priests are needed more than ever. According to Bishop Thomas Tobin, the median age of priests in the Providence Diocese is 68 years old, and there are just 21 priests younger than 40 years old. We're not in crisis mode, we're in a time of invitation, a time of uh, recollection and to really review and what we're doing and look at new ways that we can uh, reach men who are thinking about priesthood who may not even be on our radar. Father Murphy says the diocese already holds recruitment camps and open houses at the seminary. They also visit middle and high schools across the state. This is an invitation to work harder for sure. But the priest shortage isn't a problem isolated to Rhode Island. It's really a global issue. Just this week, Pope Francis spoke about the need for priests in Europe. He cited scandals in the church and cultural trends as reasons young people are turning away from priesthood. We want to live a life of purpose and meaning and that's what the priesthood has to offer. This year, four priests are slated to retire, while just one man is set to be ordained to the priesthood next month. I'm Julianne Lima, Eyewitness News.